Well, the manatee population is diminishing and conservationists now fear for the gentle giant's future. Some are calling for manatees to be listed as endangered under the Federal Endangered Species Act. And News Channel 8's Brittany Muller is in Apollo Beach after talking with zoo experts today. During the winter months, hundreds of manatees come here to the Tico power plant in Apollo Beach for the warm water. It's an incredible sight to see. Take a look. And while it looks like these animals are thriving, experts say these majestic creatures are in danger. Oh, look, look, look. These seven year old twins brought their grandma from Michigan who's escaping the cold like these manatees. I've seen a bunch of manatees, stingrays, a bunch of stuff. Tampa Electric's power plant in Apollo Beach gives these gentle giants critical protection from the chilly temperatures. Even though they're large, they're not made of a lot of blubber. They really um, don't have those fat storages to stay warm. So you're going to see hundreds congregated at a time. They kind of look like rocks sticking out of the water. Jamie Vaccaro is the associate curator of Florida and manatees at Zoo Tampa. The critical care center is currently rehabilitating 19 manatees. Manatees face a lot of issues. You know, some of those are natural. Some are also um, human inflicted. Um, so there's a lot of ways that we can help coexist with the species out in the wild. That kind of starts with all of us. Vaccaro says that is partially due to an unusual mortality event from starvation in the Indian River Lagoon, causing the manatee population to rapidly decline. Several years ago, manatees were reclassified as threatened instead of endangered. Um, numbers were kind of flourishing. That was in 2017, but that's no longer the case. Since 2020, Florida Fish and Wildlife statistics show more than 3,000 manatees have died. And with 7,500 Florida manatees left in the wild, environmental organizations are calling for the mammal to be reclassified as a threatened species. I do think it's important to put them back on the endangered species list. Anytime an animal can be classified as endangered, that, that adds a lot of protection um, and different laws for them that they really do require. So what's next? The U.S. Fish and Wildlife Agency is in the middle of the process to see if manatees need to be uplisted to endangered species once again. In Apollo Beach tonight, Brittany Muller, 8 on your side.